Muslim leaders have condemned a school in Taita Taveta County said to force Muslim students to attend church services. They say that this infringes on their constitutional rights on f and freedom of worship. And as KTN's Sharon Mamanyi now reports, this is not the first time such a case has occurred in the country. <laughs> As the Muslim community continues observing the holy month of Ramadan, a matter touching on the faith is brewing at a school in Taita Taveta County. It is alleged that Muslim students at the Bura Girls High School are forced to attend church services, something that their parents are protesting. <laughs> So we are going to tell Professor Kaimeni, we will write to him, we will call him on Monday. Na huyo mwalimu ndiyo anaharibu Kenya ambaye tunaijenga, ambaye ni Kenya ambaye wa Islamu wa Kristo, it is alleged that 40 Muslim students were suspended on Monday after refusing to attend a church service last Sunday. This is not the first time a religious controversy has occurred in schools. In 2014, the High Court stopped Muslim students at St. Paul Kiwanjani School in Isiolo County from wearing hijabs and trousers. The court ruled that the move to allow a section of students to attend the school in their religious attire was unlawful and against the school's regulations. Because the petition, I will officially be presenting it in Parliament next week so that Parliament can be able to endorse and ensure that there is no religious hatred and division that will continue in this country. In 2012, the High Court also ruled against a quest to have 48 Muslim girls attending the Kenya High School in Nairobi to wear hijab while in school. The court ruled that that would amount to discrimination of the other students who would be required to continue wearing their prescribed school uniform. <laughs> To simame, to a sobran, to a tolerance. The question begs, should schools allow Muslim girls to wear hijabs at the institutions? And should they force the students to attend Christian prayers? Sharma Mani, KTN.